Shadowan family. First and foremost, I just want to give all praises and glory to Yahweh, Baha Sham, Yahweh Shai, Rakothi Yahweh, Baha Sham, Yahweh Shai, Baha Sham, Rakakwadash. Give double honors to our apostles of Great Millstone, our true spiritual teachers. Peace and salutations to our sincere brothers, pushing this truth throughout the four corners of the earth, risking their lives week in and week out. Shout out to our sincere brothers and sisters, waiting for our Heavenly Father to remove us from this present kingdom. which has been run by the devil, the evil, yeah? This world we live in is, look at it as trees, yeah? This, tr this, this, this place is filled with bad trees and good trees, and good and, good and bad can't mix. Yeah, so we look forward to Lord. When if we're chosen, we look forward to being in that righteous place where all the trees are good, no more bad trees. Yeah, because you know, when it comes to the Lord, you know, He talks about a fruitful tree. Any tree that bears any bad fruit must be hewn down. So this leads me to this scripture. In John chapter 15, Yahweh Shai, the true vine. I am the true vine, and my father is the husbandman. Every branch in me that beareth not fruit. He taketh away. What's the point? Having a tree. And that tree is not bearing any good fruit. Nothing good has come from that from that tree. What's the point? You cut that down. Every branch in me that beareth not fruit. He taketh away, and every branch that beareth fruit, he purgeth it, that it may bring forth more fruit. Right? And that's what you want to do. You want to live in a kingdom where you've got trees that just flourishing. Yeah? Anything that is evil must be casted out. Right? So let me just go to leads me quickly to um it's just a short one I was thinking about because this place that we're living in is just you know filthy we're going to Galatians chapter chapter 5 verse 22 the fruit of the spirit that's how we have to pray for the for that spirit that good spirit that good, that good, um, Salakia. We have to pray for that good spirit, yeah? Because you remember there's a balance. We're not going to pray for a bad spirit, are you? But because we, we're living amongst this evil, wicked nation, right? These things rub off on you. That's why we have to keep on praying that we are purged, right? That's so why we need to get off here, brothers and sisters. We need to get away from this place. Because it just produces bad trees. Right? Fruit of the Spirit. Galatians chapter 5, 22. But the fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, long-suffering, Gentleness, goodness, faith, meekness, temperance. 
against such there is no law and they that are the anointing the anointed have crucified the flesh with the affections of lust if we live in the spirit let us also walk in the spirit so if we're trying to be spiritual people to the best of our ability we pray for that righteous spirit we have to also walk in that spirit there's no point just putting on that that spiritual face as if you know you're filled with the spirit the good spirit remember hot and cold can't mix hot and cold does not mix let us not be desirous of vain glory and that's where that pride comes in you don't even realize when pride takes over and this place is filled with pride yeah that's how we can't mix with these people we can't mix with people that bear bad fruit let us not be desirous of vain glory provoking one another envying one another and this word is full of envy jealousy yeah and negativity and we want to live in a world where all that is going to be taken away removed there's going to be no more envying no more provoking one another no more jealousy yeah so we have to pray for that righteous spirit continue to pray for the holy spirit on the right hand side and it's very important when you say any prayers make sure you ask for the holy spirit on the right hand side specifically right hand side because there's two types of spirit you have the left hand spirit and you have the right hand spirit. You remember, you've got people in this world, you know, that, that you, you might think that they're doing well, yeah? But they pray for the evil spirit because they want to do evil things. All right? To create contention. Yeah, look what's going on now. The co contention within different camps. That's why these bad trees need to be cut down. These bad trees need to be burnt down. And start afresh. That's why that kingdom, when the kingdom comes, everything's going to be burnt down and it's going to be renewed. It's going to be replenished with good trees. Yeah? If you have a good tree, the brown, let me go back to it again. John 15, verse 1. I am the true vine, and my father is the house husbandman. Every branch in me that beareth not fruit. He taketh away, and every branch that beareth fruit, he purgeth it, that it may bring forth more fruit. And that's what the kingdom is about. It's about this replenishing, replenishing, replenishing. Yeah? Good fruit. Not this evil kingdom. The more they plant those trees, more the more the evil trees are planted yeah the bad trees is going to give off bad fruit the branches are not going to deliver good fruit because the root is bad yeah it stems from the root
So let us continue to pray for that, you know, that Holy Spirit, the good spirit to come upon you. Yeah. Shalom, yeah, shalom.